Hi, everybody. Um, today is Monday, November 21st. Lots of people gone today, I imagine, uh, that you are on your way to someplace fun. I hope you're on your way to someplace fun and you're not sick. Um, listen, we're not going to be doing a whole, whole lot this week because I anticipated some kids being gone. Um, your objective today is that you can practice using different learning strategies to begin studying the vocabulary words and key concepts for rock transformations. So first things first, I want you to go to GoodNotes, create a new folder, title it Rock Transformations, and then I want you to move this uh, student copy of your graphic organizer into that document. I have the graphic organizer key, so you can go ahead and um, fill that out ahead of time so that we don't have to take a whole lot of time during class when we get to these. Um, also, don't forget to include your progress build topics. Um, like for progress build number one, the topic is rock formations. For number two, it's sediment and magma. And for PB3, it is movement of rock formations. There are 11 key concepts, and I don't want you to panic because a lot of these are still relying on your understanding of the key concepts from plate motion. So like look at key concept number seven, plate motion moves rock formations. And so if you remember um, convergent plate boundaries, we've got one plate that goes under another one. And as that one goes under, it's going to take all of the rock formations that are on Earth's outer layer, which is hard solid rock. It's going to take those and it's going to move them and they're going to move them down. If you look at key concept number eight, subduction moves rock down below Earth's outer layer. So it's just building on the key concepts that you already understand from um, the plate motion unit that we just finished up. When you're finished with that, I want you to go ahead and create either a Quizlet or flashcards or um, Book It or whatever you want to to create flashcards for um, the vocabulary and then also for the 11 key concepts. So you will have 31 flashcards total. This rock transformation glossary, there are two pages. So there's 20 words total. And then um, there are 11 key concepts. So if you look, uh, when you're finished with that, you can't turn it into me. Um, I'll just ask for it when I see you next week. Um, but you should have 31 entries total. All right? Take care. I hope everybody is happy and well. And I will see you next week.